I learned about Sovereign when I showed up at the front doors here at uh, 7 o'clock on a Saturday night. I was supposed to be here at 4 and I was actually supposed to be in Murrieta at another facility which I thought this was part of the other facility, but it ended up not being that. So I actually stayed here and um, I had some friends that went into recovery and treatment at the other facility that I'm referring to. And so I was a little anxious about that because I kind of wanted to be with them. And um, I'm actually glad I did. This, is, it, this was the best thing and a good thing that I accidentally ended up here, which actually ended up not being an accident at all. It's the right thing for me, so I'm, I feel blessed about that. I actually was um, on the streets for a few years uh, prior to coming here and uh, as you know uh, maybe part of uh, being on the streets the addiction thing um, becomes a, a big problem and uh, I'm at the point in my life I really felt that, that I was I'm ready to just you know stop the drugs and um, I'm just, it, it was just my time I felt that and uh, I just wanted to come to treatment to um, get the tools not only to get over the drug addiction, but just to get my head right, which um, being here at Sovereign, I didn't really realize uh, how much that has affected my, my thinking and the way my brain um, is supposed to uh, work. And um, I'm, I'm amazed at, at the results, you know, clearly seeing, wow, you know, it, my brain was not functioning the way it should be. And I, I had no idea about that until now. I really knew nothing about this program when I first came in. The first few days were tough, you know, going through detox, I was a little confused. But um, going through the COG lab, I um, actually had gone onto the Sovereign website and uh, I took the opportunity to research about the company. I read, read a lot of stuff and I actually am continuing when I get a um, chance to go in there to, to um, read on the company and it, it's amazing you guys do a lot of stuff. To help. So actually it's, it, I'm more excited about being here because you guys do a lot of stuff helping people and it's, it's amazing to me. This is a really, really good company. know about Sovereign helping from other treatment programs uh, all I know about that I really have no knowledge personally I just know what I know from other other clients from people that have been in recovery this is my first time um, being in and actually um, from what I hear from other people this will be my first and last time because I guess I picked the best one so I'll never have to return to um to uh, being in a rehab so it's good First of all, I was ready to like jet out of the parking lot because I was a few hours late with actually being here. And um, when uh, I was on the on the phone on my cell phone, I was like, "No, no, no, don't leave! There's someone still there up there." I'm like, "What? Surely there's nobody here at this hour." And um, sure enough, somebody came down the doors and unlocked, and they're like, "Jennifer." And I'm like, "Yeah." And they're like, "Oh, you know, come in." I'm like, "Oh my gosh, there's really somebody here." So that was like, oh, "Wow, that was amazing that they actually took me in at that time of night." And there was nobody else actually there except for the guy that brought me in and um so that was pretty cool he was really um like his tone of voice and the way you know he made me feel relaxed he didn't make me feel uncomfortable or i mean you know at that point you know my state of mind you know a little fragile but um i didn't i didn't feel uh like i was ready to run out the door let's just tell you that i felt comfortable i stayed The only thing I, I really expected was actually just to uh, get to the point of not wanting to use drugs anymore, not think about drugs, just to get over my addiction. And um, so much more uh, that I've learned and that I have got that I, I had no idea about. Like I said earlier, you know, my thinking and being able to just the way I physically react to things, not only drugs, but just, you know, just life in general um, and uh, just your thoughts, you know, just in a positive way and be able to go out in society and just, you know, working, just interacting with people. So that, and that's been cool. Every day I've been uh, learning tools, um, working with the tools that they give me that I never even knew about. Like, it's just helping me to be a better person um, all around, giving me um, a positive attitude and make me feel better. I'm like happier, happier like every day. I'm like, huh. My expectations of the program, just getting over the addiction, um, but uh, actually there's a lot more that I got out of the program that I wasn't even expecting or even knew about. The residents that I stayed in so far in the program, uh, I started out with the detox um, house, and that, that to me was just wonderful. I'm, I slept a lot, of course, um, but they provided a, 
all the needs that I didn't even know I needed, but I did be in there. And so I actually didn't want to move out of that place because I was so comfortable. I just wanted to stay there forever. But the next facility I moved into was just amazing. And I'm like, wow, I can't believe I wanted to stay in detox. This is even more amazing. So that was a, um, a beautiful um, place I stayed in, nice view. Um, rooms were nice, uh, the, the management, um, the girls, it was all, all good. The house was beautiful, all, everything they provided was nice. And so I actually didn't want to move out of there either. And then the next house I went into was even more amazing. So everything was uh, provided, uh, well taken care of, well managed, it, it was good. My experience with the therapists and staff have been very positive. I have never worked with any um, psychiatrists, uh, you know, doctors on, on a personal level or there's anything like that before. This is my first time. So, um, you know, I've heard a lot about, you know, therapy and I've always kind of had a negative attitude like, oh, I don't need that, I need that. So going in with a positive attitude and just um, listening, it's been a good experience because uh, they really seem to speak to you uh, like at a personal level that like just you know, not like textbook, like in general, saying the same thing to everybody. It's like really um, geared right towards you, like targeted right to exactly what is going on with you. So I, I like that. The group therapy sessions here at Sovereign. Um, at first, I really wasn't wanting to participate. I was a little uncomfortable at first, especially being in a... Um, you know the all all women kind of sharing sharing our feelings, but um, actually I was comfortable right away, and I think it's like the instructor with the way they lead the classes. It it really gets you to just don't worry about what's around you, just to focus on yourself and get your feelings out. And once you do it, it, it really um just helps with like everything in your life just to get the negative stuff out or think about things that you never even knew affected you in a negative way. It just start once you start doing that, it's like. You start recalling things in your in your life that maybe you never thought about until just right that moment again, and it just and it just keeps going and going, and then just the more that happens, the more positive things, and the more you benefit from that. So um, that's what I like about the group. And then also with the groups, you kind of follow the same the same women as you move through the program, so you get comfortable with those women too, and you get to know them and build a rapport with them. So it's it's nice. It's not anything uncomfortable. It's just you know sharing. You feel you feel good about it. One of my favorite groups here at Sovereign is uh, the process group. I like I like the process group because you can just, you know, in the other groups you have a subject and you kind of like want to want to stay on on subject, but process group pretty much anything goes that's not inappropriate, and um, it's kind of nice. You can just talk about anything and everybody can just dive in and just say say whatever. And it usually goes pretty good. It doesn't get out of control. It's all pretty pretty helpful. Pretty helpful information with um, everybody's input. Um, a typical day here uh, at treatment, uh, it actually goes pretty fast. You you would think, oh, I gotta go to group, I gotta go to group, and then people are just like, oh, negative attitude. But it actually goes fast because it's very interesting. All all the groups are fun. Um, you just go to a couple groups, you have lunch. They always have a great lunch, great food here that they give you. Um, then you just they have another another group session, and then you go home. And then uh, you know as you progress in in the program, you uh, move up a level. You just you come in even later, a couple hours, and you go home. So it's, it's nice. That's, that's um, you know, here at the center. What I like about most about Sovereign, um, well, their location I like. Um, their location, uh, I really like all the different things that they do here to help help uh, a lot of people. They do a lot of things to address a lot of um, a lot of issues with, with um, many different people. I like the facility. I, I like um, the instructors. I like the, um, the the groups. I think they're targeted towards I mean the right things. They're, they're um, right on with that. Very helpful. Um, it, I don't feel that any information or anything they give you is just like you just like oh I got nothing out of that that was just a waste of time so I think they're right on with that stuff and there's also a lot of extra things too that they do that um, that help and um, I love the um, the transportation which I always call it my limo that they always um, you know drive us around to everything and to do things and activities and, and all that and um, I think that's great and um, the houses just living with with um, 
different people and working together um, living in the living uh, environment is, is great. Everything's real nice. I like it. From my experience here, what I will take with me when I leave, which you wouldn't expect I would say this, you'd probably think it would be like a drug or anything, but it's actually um, interacting with people. Realizing that everybody is different and not treating them or judging them. I mean, at my age, that's been, I mean, coming, I've known that my whole life, but actually applying that and, and, and being okay with people being different and accepting them and, and feeling okay about that, that's been a huge thing for me. Not feeling any negativity at all. It, it, it's actually refreshing. I actually have a lot to say about this program and um, I've told a few people um, so far and, and, and actually being in treatment I never have enough time or can talk fast enough to tell them so many good things and about it. Um, I'm actually um, currently actually working on um, speaking with my son about this program. Um, he's young, he's 22, he's an addict and uh, I'm just telling him positive things um, and you know at his age I don't want to uh, you know, tell him anything that is like going to be a chore to him. The positive, refreshing things, letting him know there's a lot of young people. Um, there's young men his age and even younger. Let him know that, you know, there's kids that have been exactly where you are or even worse and they come in, in where they are now. And um, it's amazing when I go to meetings and I see these, these young men that are the same age as my son and I'm like, and where they're at is just like, wow. I cannot, I, I, I can't even believe it. And so I try to tell my son stuff like that, positive things. And so I'm, I'm hoping that, you know, his time will come and, and he'll remember that stuff. But um, definitely this treatment center is, is something that I, I hope he considers because we're from here at San Clemente. So I, I'm, I'm all for him coming here. Court services affected my treatment in the most positive way and um, what I can say about those ladies that helped me I had uh, I had a court date when I first got into treatment I was still in detox and I had to go to court uh, for a ticket I had and I went there and um, I had scheduled uh, rescheduled to see a judge and so um, she had I met with me and uh, we went she, they went to court with me and um, the um, court recognized sovereign, um, sovereign as a you know treatment center in a, in a positive way. So that was one good thing that they were with me there. But um, when we went in the morning, the judge, okay, I was asking the best outcome of this. I was asking him to just dismiss my case, okay. And then the next best, oh, can you just reduce my fines? Well, all the people that went before me, clearly the judge was not dismissing anything, and clearly he wasn't reducing any fines. So I'm just like, oh. And so when I went up there, you know, I'm like, oh, could you, you know, dismiss my fines? And I had a letter, you know, Shannon, you know, prepped me on what to say and everything. And so I went up there and I go, and I'm in recovery, you know, with Sovereign and I have this letter. He's like, let me see the letter. I mean, he didn't even read it. You know, he saw me with, with, with the ladies out there and he's just like, you know, you're doing the right thing and I, you know, I'm dismissing this case. And I was just like, oh. That was just wonderful. And so, you know, I was telling the girls on the way back, I go, you know what, you guys? I go, if you guys wouldn't have came with me and this would have went any other way I can tell you that it would totally affected my sobriety not only my recovery but totally in a negative way because I could totally see that just messing my my program up here it would have just you know so that was like huge for me with those guys being with me So now at this point, how I feel about the court services here at Sovereign, without um, having them um, have helped me at all, I would probably say it, it, it's a good it's a good thing to have that for people like me that you know need their help. But now that they have helped me, I think it is actually a good thing to provide for um, clients here that, that that need their help. I think it's a, a really good thing that you guys have. Um, an option for people or something that you provide for people that need the help because you never know I mean just something uh, just going into a courtroom or, or any legal services just going in on your own and I mean you could be on your game and it's like oh no get out of here or you could not be on your game and have someone from Sovereign representing you and like oh yes anything you want sure and sign off on it so it, it's good good reputation so I, I think it's good Legal issues is not one of the one of the main reasons why I came here to Sovereign. 